What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dr. Fix Studios, and we are inside of IIS, inside of one virtual 2016 server, and we got a SQL server running in another virtual 2016 server. So what we got here is that we've got an error, a network-related or instance-specific error occurred while establishing a connection to SQL Server. Basically, it's saying that it cannot find that SQL Server. First thing we're going to do is come over here to our services. So we need to go inside of Control Panel, open it up. If you do not see this, come over here to View By and choose Large Icons. Choose Administrative Tools. Come over here to Services and scroll all the way down to your SQL Server, which is right here. You want to choose SQL Server Browser, and as you can tell, it is not running. Right click on it and choose Start. Okay, go ahead and keep that window open. Come down here to Windows Firewall and Advanced Security. Choose Inbound Rules. And right over here, choose New Rule. We're going to choose Port and then choose Next. Then choose All Ports, then click on Next. And then Allow the Connection. Click on Next. Leave that default. Click finish. Open up SQL Server. Come over here to protocols and ports. And we want to change this to any. Come down here and click on apply. And then click on OK. You can go ahead and close out of this. And the last thing we want to do is open up our start menu. Come down here to our M's to our SQL Server. And choose SQL Server 2016 configuration. Once it opens, come down here to SQL Server network configuration. Click on a little arrow. Choose protocol for your server. Open up TCP IP, come over here and choose yes. Get rid of the zero and change this to 1433. Click on apply, choose OK, click OK. Go ahead and close out of this window. Open services back up, right click on SQL Server and choose restart and choose yes. OK, go ahead and go back inside of your web server, right click and choose reload and choose continue. And now everything's working like it's supposed to. I am Wayne Barron, the Starkfix Studios, inside of SQL Server 2016, inside of a virtual machine, and running IIS inside of another virtual machine. Y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.